touch you on my ground, one here, I'll blow your brains out. Son of a bitch, you don't. What's the matter with you guys? Why does it seem like Karens can pop up to ruin any situation in an instant? Welcome back to Ocean Media. Today, we start with a Karen who saw some fishermen at the lake and decided to tell them off, claiming they weren't allowed to fish there, despite the fishermen having permission. Watch as she refuses to accept their explanation. You should not be out here. We have permission to fish no, here, though. You should respect the wishes of the property owners who live here. I think y'all should leave right now. We're just fishing. It's very harmless. She clearly can't mind her own business. Approaching the fisherman, who had permission from a local resident to fish at the lake, she starts questioning and denying everything they say, visibly annoyed. So what did Brent say? Okay. Call Brent. I will call him. Right now? No, I think I should leave right now. Well, it's one person's word versus another right now, so... <laughs> I mean, sure, yeah. No, no not called? sure about that. I'm sorry that you feel this way. We're just fishing. <laughs> now, we encounter a Karen harassing people engaged in magnet fishing, a method used for cleaning up water by removing metal objects. Despite their environmental efforts, this Karen is determined to cause trouble. See how it unfolds. I have this lady here, Karen, I can call her that we are doing something we're recycling out the water this is not your property and it's neither is yours we called the property owner here that with the phone number that was up thank you very much unless maybe she's got something to hide back in the water i didn't touch your fence you're not that much skinnier either i was on the brick part you're not that much skinnier either lady Here's a Karen who got so triggered by two boys fishing, accusing them of trespassing. The boys fight back, but she doesn't like that one bit. We were told this was public for anybody who lives here. Then you don't live here. We do. Where's your we dress? live down the street. Where's your dress? 45. Kiss my ass. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Out. Yeah, I'd rather not. That's kind of creepy. Go. Out. The yard's a piece of crud. Pictures of me? What's that going to do? Go. What <laughs> Pictures? That's so... Jerks? Jer jerks? Yes. For fishing? For fishing. It's fishing. Trespassing. It's fishing. It's fishing. You're trespassing. This is private property. All of a sudden, she starts calling them names and insulting them again. Then, in a bigger turn of events, she starts playing the victim, claiming that they were harassing her. A oh, no. mugshot. <laughs> A mugshot for fishing? That's hysterical. That's his, that's hysterical. Get the hell out. For fishing, okay. Okay, ma'am. All right. Apparently, they were trespassing in what looked to be a public space. But hey, you know how Karens are. See them signs posted in here? Yeah. I catch you in here. I cut you on my ground. Go in here. I'll blow your brains out. I'm a trooper, and I'll get away with it. I catch you in here. I cut you on my ground. Go in here. I'll blow your brains out. I'm a state trooper, and I'll get away with it. Son of a bitch, you don't. What's the matter with you guys? This next, Karen came to harass a fisherman who was just minding his own business by the pier. She claims that he was killing animals for no reason, but he was just following a simple catch and release practice. Just check it out for yourselves. Why don't you just kill that fish and throw it back in and kill it? I didn't kill it. You did so. I saw it and it's floating here. I tried to release it, but it didn't release, so I did not kill it. You did. I saw it here and it's just flapping up and around. You've got to hide. Can I see your fishing license? I do have a fishing license. Yeah, good. I'll put you on YouTube as well. That's all right. I'm, uh, there's nothing wrong that I've done. Absolutely nothing wrong. 
I know my I know my rules and regulations. Why? That's okay. That's okay. I'm allowed to release fish like that. Kill that. You can call the DPI now if you want the Department of Primary Industries. You can give them a call. And Balmain Police. Yes, you can do that. Yeah, I will. Yes, you could do that. I know. Don't worry about it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Now we have a fisherman who seemed like he had been through this all before. A Karen came up to him and started complaining about his fishing and how he was apparently harming the wildlife. This guy, though, was unfazed. Just look at this. What sign's that? We're not disturbing wildlife. Here, and the swans trying to raise their young, and you guys are got plastic fishing line out. Do you think that's very appropriate? Plastic fishing line. <sighs> Do you even care? Like, I respect wildlife. I catch and release fish, and I follow the law. This Karen was trying to sort out these fishermen who, according to him, were trespassing, but he had no proof to state that. So the fishermen were having absolutely none of it. But unfortunately for them, the Karen remained extremely persistent. What, what are we doing that's wrong to disturb you? Just, just, tell, just, let, just let me in on that yeah, and we'll like, leave. Like, so is throwing plastic on plastic line on a graphite hook, a graphite rod disturbing you? Is it, and is it bugging you? Am I touching you? Am I? I'm gonna answer your question. No, I want you to answer that now. I don't want that to be the first thing. Okay, go ahead. Is it wrong? Steal? What? Stealing? Yes. What does that mean to you? If somebody steals from me. Well, what, what are, are we stealing? Doing? What are we stealing? Are you doing what's right? A what? Okay. You're breaking the law. This what? is private property. Do not trespass. I would like. I would like proof. I want. I want to come. Yeah, we have a whole sheet that says this is like. This, this is, is Grant County. Not HOA. So Gwinnett County does not... This couple was harassing two kids who were fishing at a lake. And the lake happened to be next to houses, but it was a public lake, and they had every right to be there. The Karens tried to argue with them, but the kids came out with proof just to prove them wrong. They were clearly ahead of the game. Uh, we're not supposed to be fishing here. This is private property. Um, no, it's not. Yes, it is. Too bad. It's, it's H-O-A. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Come here, I got something to show you. I don't care what you've got to show us. It's H O A. Are you John? No, I'm not John. Oh, John's your neighbor. To you yet. John's your neighbor. All right, you see this? See that piece of land? That's that right there. Yes. Guess who owns it? Gwinnett oh. County. That's right, but it's our H O A. We saved the very best for last with this clip. Here we have a Karen who is very dedicated to being a complete party pooper to these two fishermen who were just quietly enjoying a beautiful day of fishing and then eventually decided to jump in the water naked. Just check this out. It's a little unacceptable, but we'll leave. Just trying to fish, that's all we're doing. Thanks for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, then feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more content like this and much more. Goodbye for now, everyone. We'll see you next time.